Hello everyone, and welcome back to John and Mandy Go RVing. Thanks for joining us here at the 2022 Hershey RV Show. Today we are here sharing with everyone the 2023 Integra Anthem 44D Class A Diesel Luxury Motorhome. This diesel pusher has newly designed premium leather crown compass furniture and an all new Integra Coach Safe View Dash, which allows the driver to keep their eyes on the road, the mirrors, in a center console display without having to look down at all. This Class A is 44 feet 11 inches long and 12 feet 8 inches in height. It comes equipped with a Cummins L9 turbocharged 450 horsepower diesel engine with 1,250 pounds-feet of torque at 1,400 RPM and a 15,000 pound hitch tow capacity. There are three 15,000 BTU air condition units with heat pumps and a condensation drain system to keep you cool on those hot summer days, and an Aqua Hot 450D hydronic water and heating system with in floor heat throughout, plus a 5000 BTU electric fireplace to keep you warm during those cooler months, a 3000 watt pure sine wave inverter, four L16 AGM batteries, 290 watt solar panels, and let's not forget the on and 10,000 watt diesel generator on a powered side out tray. Well, now that we have talked about some of the features and specifications for the 2023 Integra Anthem 44D, let's take a closer look at what this luxury motorhome has to offer, starting with the outside. So, starting with the outside here, we have these slam latch doors. You can push that button there, that opens her up. And there we have a cooler. More storage here. It's a pull out tray, it goes the whole way through. Let's check this one out. Again, another pass through. And it is carpeted in here. I'm not sure why they like to put carpet in the basement of these. Because you're going to get it all dirty real quick. Just doesn't make sense to me to have these carpets in these. Well, there ain't nothing going on there. Looks like a tank though. You fill up from outside. Here we have the batteries, house batteries. Going around the back, it has a beautiful, awesome looking back on it. I love the back on these Integras, these diesel pushers. In my opinion, the aesthetics on these Integras, like the cornerstones and the anthems, is superior to everyone, but that's my opinion. Okay, so we got our wet bay in here. Also have your levers for your black tank and gray tank. Here's your power bay, your power supply on a reel. Something like this, you better have a reel for it, the money you're paying for it. Another pass through, and that's pretty much what the rest of them are going to be, I think. We'll go down and check this last one yet. Your leveling system. 
So I'm sure many of you wonder how we're able to travel as often as we do. One tool we like to use when looking for campgrounds is Thousand Trails. It's a campground membership with plans to meet your camping needs. The Thousand Trails system offers a variety of RV sites, tent sites, and cabins, plus many offer a ton of amenities and activities. Many are located near popular vacation destinations. We found that the campground serve as a perfect home base when we're exploring new areas. Thousand Trails can work for the weekend campers, full-time RVers, and every type of camper in between. The membership specialists will work with you personally to fit the membership to your camping needs and budget. Contact Michael and Lori, membership specialists who are ready to answer your questions. And please don't forget to mention John and Mandy Go RVing when you call. So coming in the door here, you do have a combination lock. So here's the new dash display that we were talking about. See how it seems to be a little bit lower. This is up higher so you don't have to look down at the screen at all. Beautiful. And then you have a TV up here. Storage on either side above. There's no overhead bunk in this. So that frees up space for more cabinets, air condition overrides, slide outs. All right, let me get into the living room area here. We have a sofa on this side, and we have one on this side. That's theater seating. You got the USB ports in it, cup holders. This opens up. Above the couch across from it, you'll have the televator here and more cabinets. And you even have a sound bar in the middle there. All right, coming over to the kitchen area, you have a two burner induction stove, Furion. And this lid that goes over it, you can find up above the microwave or storage for it here. And you have a convection microwave. Got some storage on either side. Pretty deep. And this one has a rack that comes out. Look at all those remotes. Lovely giant sink here, telescoping, underneath, sponge drawer, trash can drawer, everything drawer, everything you can think of, dishwasher, this pulls out to give you more space for cooking, you also have a cutting board and a top here in the top drawer and two more drawers underneath. Turning to the other side now we have the dinette which does drop down to make a bed. Above that we have some more storage. Next to the dinette we have the residential fridge and a nice size pantry. The bottom drawer does come out. Across from the fridge and pantry, we have the information center and a half bath with a porcelain toilet, a little bit of storage there, and these two. Nice size sink in here, too. Another information center. Pretty nice. Okay, on to the bedroom. You have a king size bed with end tables and a little bit of storage on either side as well as outlets. A 
up above here, we got some deep storage as well. You can actually fit a kid in there to sleep if you really wanted to. You have a mirror on the other side of the bed. Then across from the bed, you have storage for your clothes. You have the TV there with a sound bar. Let's look in these cabinets here. You got your DVD Blu-ray player. Nice size drawers. Same thing on this side, identical. All right, let's step into the full-size bathroom here. Look at that shower. Mm-mm-mm. And you have a seat in there, too, if you need to sit down for showers. Porcelain toilet here. A little bit of storage above the toilet. Put some linens in there. A little spot there for your cats to hang out if you got any. Across from the shower and the toilet, you have his and her sink. Storage right up above, medicine cabinet with mirrors. Same thing for all three of them. You have outlets on either side. You have another control monitor there. And that's identical on either side as well for the sinks. You can put your toothbrush and stuff in there, toothpaste. Drawers are pretty deep. All the way down, pretty deep. Nice size cabinets. Alrighty, stepping into the closet, because it is a walk-in closet. We have storage here for stackable washer and dryer. Yeah! Plenty of room to hang up clothes. You even have a section here for shoes. And again, if you really wanted to, someone could throw down a pillow and a sleeping bag, and that makes another spot to sleep. A little bit more up here for storage. Some more storage here for clothes or whatever. And I believe that is it for this unit. Well, thanks everyone for joining us today on this tour. If you found this video helpful at all, please give us a like and hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions or comments, leave it in the comment section below, and we'll see you next time. Take care, everyone.